I want to go and take a look at what the fuck this is over here. First, however. Oh, this is where I started. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> okay, then. Oh, cliff top was over there. I think I want to go to the cliff top first. Maybe I can jump off. See if I can fly in my dreams. That would be great. Um, am I lost already? No, I think I'm... I think I'm going the right way here. Who knows at this point. Give me a whole bunch of... Oh, look at that sweet lens flare. <laughs> okay, here we go. We're going to the graveyard. Hopefully there won't be anything spooky. Anything in here? What's in here? Oh, this is kind of spooky. Uh, here we have another note. To dream that you are in the cave represents a need of in to in introspect. Wow, I'm struggling reading in my dream here. Usually revealing a more adventurous side to the dreamer signals self-discovery. Yep, I want to self-discover myself as much as possible. As I kind of am exploring. Oh, I still got my cargo pants on. That's good. Um, looks like there's two sides to this place, left and right. Hopefully I'm going the right way. It looks like we can just cross over easily. Like this. Look for any papers here. Any secret papers? Dreaming that you're lost means that you lose direction in your life. Dreaming of rocks means that you lack stability. Dreaming of grass popping out of sand means you're dreaming of uh, starting a new life. Oh, I can't get in there. Oh, God. Hello. Well, <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> Why can't I get in there? Is that a bug? Oh, there we go. Fuck you, game. Yes. Here we go. So we're in my bedroom. I doubt this dreaming of your own bedroom means absolutely nothing. I think I'm stuck in here now. Great. Oh. Yeah, I trapped myself in my bedroom. Let's get up on this rock then. Oh, Christ. This was a bad idea. There we go. Fucking. Hey. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit, how am I gonna get out of here? I'm trapped. Oh, you just crawl through it. I'm a dumbass. Oh, well, thanks for explaining that game. So are we going the right way here? Graveyard and is... Wait, wait a minute. I'm gonna go to the graveyard or the hollow? Um, let's go to the graveyard, I guess. <laughs> that's, a, that's a good idea, right? Shit, am I like... Oh, I'm so lost, to be honest. Dreaming of rocks in the middle of a, a pathway means you're... Uh, means something is obstructing you. What do we have here? Whoa, it doesn't look too inviting down there. Who would even build something so unwelcoming? Well, fuck it, why not? Let's go. Music has changed. If there's a smoke monster in here, I'm out. I'm done. I'm not doing this. I'm not interested in running away from a smoke monster again. Pretty sure this is the catacombs. Pretty sure I'm in the catacombs. I've made a mistake. This is where I was the the first time. You kind of come out and there's a computer or something. Don't go and watch the other the video that I did. It's really shit and uh, the microphone quality and everything was bad. Don't watch it. Just watch this. Chill out. We're going to the graveyard. It'll be fun. Trust me. Uh, I'm back where I started. Fuck me. I'm... Oh, God. I think I completely missed it this way the other time. I went straight there into the catacombs, but I didn't... I didn't go here this way. Looks like the graveyard's over here. Hopefully, we'll be right. And we'll be meet, meeting a nice old fucking... The hollow in the clifftop is that way. Get out of my face, son. The graveyard is back there. What do you mean? That is nonsense. I don't believe you. Oh, fuck. We're back here. God damn it. Let's go to the hollows. Fuck it. We're going to the hollows in the clifftop. I'm sick of this. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, this looks promising. No, it does not look promising at all. Actually. Uh, is this the cliff top? Oh wow, this is a brilliant cliff top here. What the fuck? Uh, right, this way then. 
Gotta admit, I'm completely lost as balls right now. But it's natural to get lost in your dreams. You don't have a sense of direction. Oh, excuse me, I gotta duck, duck through that. <laughs> okay, here we go. This is some sort of underground passageway to my own death. What does this pole say? It says go that way. Well, fuck it. We'll go the opposite way. Right. Is there a paper around here? <sighs> right. Okay. Uh, here we have another board. What do we have here? The desert part number four. The hollows. The hollow was where disciples were brought by their orders. Am I from this planet? I can't read. Before embarking on their journey, it was meant to inspire the youths and act as a preview of their own potential. After visiting the hollow, the disciple had to choose whether to stay in the community and look after friends and family or attempt to explore the surface and risk the stigma of returning if they can't transcend their current form. Holy shit, that sounds really interesting actually. You gotta be a disciple and transcend your form? Goodness me. Oh, what was that? A popping texture in my dream. Oh god, disorientating zoom. So, I don't know how much more they've put in this game. Maybe not. Turns out I can't find the graveyard. I can see something up on that cliff. Oh, up there. Uh, I'll need to drop down from above to get it. Oh, that must be the cliff top. Okay. I'll go up to the cliff top and get that. Dreaming of falling. Well, probably be the clue. How the fuck do I get up there? Oh, what the hell is this? Is this where I went in the first time? Oh, this is the same place that I went in. Maybe I can get up these rocks here. Oh, up you get. Come on, me. What's my name? Philip? I forget. Maybe I have to go around the other side then to get up top. Top of that cliff. Doesn't look like I can break the game. Or maybe I can. Oh god, here we go. No, I don't think we can. They probably spent hours playtesting that. Being like, we must make sure that the player cannot get to that bubble. Oh fuck, we can sprint. Are you serious? I hate this. Alright, let's try and get up there. What the hell is that thing? What thing? What are you talking about? This, this thing? Okay. Uh, looks looks like we want to just follow the path, I guess. Try to get up top there. God, I can't believe I can sprint. It's really annoying. Well, how the fuck do I get up there? Um, what do we have here? Oh shit! So it looks like I can't get up. Um, this is really confusing to me. This whole experience is really confusing. Ah, fuck it. We'll go and explore this bit, whatever this thing is. What's down there? Is that the computer and the... Oh, that's where I was originally. I'm out of sprint juice. God, I have limited sprint. Okay. Desert Park. Underground. The famous tribe that lived in this part of the desert. Okay, they dwell on the ground as they believe gods walk the sands above. To see the outside world, young disciples have proved that they were worthy. Some had no interest in traveling to the surface. This meant they would never see the sun or the stars. Well, that's sad. You mean they lived in these in that maze down there? Is that a fucking bubble over there? Oh, it is. Let's go get that bubble. Can we go all the way there? Oh, shit. What the fuck is that? Little, like, nipple rock. Okay, looks like I can't get there. I can't jump over this this thing. I can't believe they limit my sprint. What the fuck is the point in that? Do I have to run away from something? That kind of hints to me that something will be chasing me if I have limited sprint. Why is the rock glowing red? I do not know. Well, shit, I can't. Oh, what the fuck is this? Have I been in here? I hope there's something worthwhile in here. Yeah, me too. What the hell are these things? Candles? Oh my god. Is this the forest? Are there going to be cannibals in here? Oh, candles, huh? 
There's all these people lighting candles. Oh my god, I can get to the cliff top through here probably. Anything else interesting in here? Oh, here we go. What is this? Candle. Burning candles in your dream may signify that good luck will be coming your way in a small and steady amount. The candle is also a symbol of hope and you should cherish whatever sh it sheds its light upon. Well, I'm cherishing these rocks pretty intensely. A sense of hope. A hope that we can get to... Okay, we'll go in there in a second. I'm pretty sure you... this is probably a path to the cliff top. Oh, cool. A makeshift diving board. Oasis beneath. No, there's nothing there. Oh, excuse me. Oh my god, I'm going to jump in this pool right here. Oh, Kawabunga! Amazing. Oh, we can swim underwater. <gasps> what is that? Glowing green shit. Let's go get it. Let's get it. Come on. Oh my god. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. Oh, it's just glowing uh, seaweed. Touch it. It's lovely. I hope I don't fucking drown down here. Won't be very pleasant. Um, Where the hell am I? <laughs> Goodness me. Okay. Is that a... F I thought it was a hedgehog. It's just a bit of... I'm not really a fan of swimming, but since this dream, there's no chance of me drowning, I hope. Okay. I really want my map to... to be here. So, f I mean, fuck it, right? We have to go down here sometime, I guess. Oh, this is really, uh... Hmm, not liking this. I guess... This is very similar to the first time I did this. You exit and there's like... A computer or something? You'll see. I wonder where all these wires lead to. Oh shit, follow the wires. Where... What the wires? These wires? Oh yeah, let's follow the wires. There we go. Here's the exit. My my. Here we are. Fantastic. What's that noise? How do I get inside this terminal? Over, he over here, of course. The first thing that's possible. What the fuck do we have here? Some kind of pie chart? I can't see what that says. Oh! What's this? Oh, yes. Right, of course. Yes, I understand that. Let's turn this baby on. Whose computer is this? No point having a password if you stick to the screen. Uh... What's, what does that say? User... Oh, fuck me. Do I have to do this? Dr. Mason... DRX28. Is that a 9 or a 4? I don't know. Let's try 9. There we go. We fucking logged in. What do we have here? Uh, terminal commands. Okay. Um, right. Very good. The following, uh, the following my tests, lights the map the smoke's proton absorption, I've been able to finally track their movements through the maze in a more predictable and safe manner than ever before. The results prove my hypothesis that the smokes prefer to move in repeating patterns of varying sizes. Blah blah blah, the smokes are so fond of their routine that they will only give chase if you have positioned yourself inside its current pattern. If you were to move inside a pattern, great. That is for when I have to run away from that. In the event of an emergency, the following position must be blah blah blah. The smokes are blah blah blah. I'm really not interested in, in reading all this. I'm sorry. You can pause it and read it if you would so like to. One of the more elusive parts of my research is why the smokes behave as they do. Unfortunately, I don't have much assist. Brilliant. Okay, what's this? Is this uh... What the fuck is all this? Oh, goodness. Okay, these are emails. No, I want to go... Oh, I can't zoom in on that. I can't read that. My eyesight is too poor. Can you read that? It's all pixelated. Even at 1080p, huh? Uh, shortcuts. What do you have in there? It's locked. Light EXE. Let's start that, shall we? What the fuck does this say? Activating this program will lock the test subject in the lower... Yeah, let's do that. Whatever. What the hell is a smoke? Did you not read the bloody thing? 
I guess it can't hurt to try turning the lights off. Though I'm not sure how, I don't remember seeing any light switches. Let's drag everything into the recycling bin. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, that's that's a brilliant piece of Okay. Awesome. Start um back out or log out. This is back out, shall we? I don't have log out, it means I have to log in again. So what do we have here? Is the wave happening? I don't want to do this. I did this the first time, it's really boring. All you do is run around turning lights off. It's really not that interesting. And this is, what is this? Connecting shit in there. I will show you the smoke if you're really interested in what it is. I think it's probably the same as the first time. Scary as balls, okay? Alright, so they turn off as I touch them. I just need to run through the maze. There's a smoke. So, there it fucking, there's the smoke right there. Jesus Christ. My goodness, let's avoid it, shall we? We gotta understand its pattern and then we can fuck it in its own butt. See, this is the part of the game where I didn't understand. I, I didn't know what they were trying to do with the game at this point. It's kind of like, it seems like the game is a kind of exploring, a kind of narrative game. And then they turn it into run away from a big giant smoke monster and turn lights off. Which I guess it's a cool like mini game, but it's not the most exciting thing in the world really. I mean you could you could do a PewDiePie and scream every time you saw it and be like, Oh god it's right there, what was that? Oh it's half of them, Jesus. I lost count too buddy, don't worry about that. Uh. Keeping my eye on where the fuck it is, to be honest. It's coming! It's gone! What the hell is that thing? Or should I do it in... Oh! What the hell is that thing? A PewDiePie voice, there you go. So, don't tell me it reset. Lights off. Uh, lights on. It didn't kill me, good. Well, that's fantastic. Only got a few more lights to go. Jump over these rocks. That actually did scare the shit out of me. Ooh, jeez. Goodbye. Let's turn the rest of these fucking lights off. I really don't see how this is like interesting in any way possible. I mean, it's a bit scary. It's not exactly completely. Oops, excuse me. <sighs> I suppose it's more scary when the lights are off. Right, here we are. What's this? Private property, huh? I thought the, like, tribes lived down here. A long time ago, they lived down here in the rocks. Jesus Christ. Well, fucking where the fuck am I? <laughs> so lost. Is that all of them? I think there was one back here somewhere. I haven't seen the smoke monster in a while. It's a good sign. Or that's good news, rather. There we go. Is this the last one? No, nope, last two. There we go. That's all of them, right? Let's just get the fuck out of here now. Oh, God. I'm so lost. I'm going to run into the smoke monster and freak the fuck out. I just know it. Oh, there's more lights over here. Hello. Oh, lights. Turn them all off. Don't. Turn off the lights. I don't turn off the lights. Oh shit, what? Uh, what was that? Uh, I thought that was the sound of a smoke monster. It's just the music. The like rattlesnake sound. Fuck is a rattlesnake sound like? Okay, I'm completely lost. Do I need to take out my compass? Fuck. Where the hell am I? <laughs> <laughs> this is not good. I'm just gonna go this way until I reach something of importance. I forgot I can sprint. I'm so sorry. Oh, there's more lights here. Fuck, I missed them. Oh shit, here we go. Uh, to see smoke in your dream indicated some sort of trouble that is entering your life. You're suffering from confusion and anxiety. In particular, if the smoke is black, then it could mean that you're not seeing some situation or proper problem clearly. 
Who the fuck comes up with all this shit? It's so dumb. To overcome or get past black smoke shows you're maturing and taking charge of your life. I mean, I dream about, like, fucking weird shit. What is that? That's not in this book, is it? Uh, to dream of a maze represents a situation where you can't focus on anything apart from getting the task at hand over with. Blah, blah, blah. That's all nonsense. All these books that tell you what your dreams mean is nonsense. Your dream is just your subconscious, like, vomiting out stuff. Okay. Let's just keep going. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I'm out of here in this. I went the wrong way. Oh, it's closed. Uh oh. I'm so boned. Let's take out my compass. What is this? Oh, this. This the. It's a what? What the? F this wasn't here the first time. Is it actually like showing me where I am on the map? Um. Okay, we'll go straight here. Left here. Right here. Uh, all the way down. The second left. Second left. Uh, and then we should be here. There we go. I'm a fucking genius. Thank you. I put put you away now. I did it. Uh, okay, one maze down. Just three to go. Well, fuck that. I'm not doing this three times. You kidding me? <laughs> what the fuck do I do this three times? No, I'm done. This is where I got really frustrated with the game and ended it the first time. I mean... Fucking... F I gotta do this three more times. Are you serious? I don't want to do it three more times. So... Thanks for watching, guys. I don't think much has changed since the last time I played it. I mean... They might have added more uh, stuff in in the future, but I'm not doing this three times to get further than that. I mean, come on, that's just that's just really annoying. So if you want to see more of this, let me know. I I will force myself. There's a bit of RAM there. Uh, I will force myself to go complete these likes just to see if there's anything interesting afterwards. Because in my opinion, this game has a lot of potential to be really interesting. A game like uh, dealing with your dreams and what they mean, like the narrative potentials are quite uh, big, large. Anyway, so thanks for watching, guys. This has been Dream. See you in the next one. Take care and peace out.